I just want to say a special thanks to Predatory Fins for giving me this amazing racing setup for my stream. I cannot wait to just play around with it. I just came back from vacation today after a week in Florida, and I got surprised with this. And I kind of freaked out because I kind of forgot about it. And I'm just happy to play around with it. If you guys remember a past video on Predatory Fins, they came to my house and took some of my Stingrays. I donated them to them, and they're in a better home now. And they kind of just surprised me with this in the video, and um, I cannot wait to post content with it. Watch out, watch out. I know, that's great. But, Ryan, whoa, whoa, this whoa. is my very first electronic roll up door. At 36 years old, finally could afford one. Boom. Oh. Today's video, I have great news, good news. It's a good video, it's a good video. We got the girls here, we're almost we finished packing. Yeah, yeah. Right? They're not too happy because they don't have makeup on. You got water on the left. That's good? Yeah. All right, perfect. Oh. Now, you watched the last video with Tank and how we built an electronic chair for him. <laughs> oh yeah. But look at him. He had his little bath already. He's doing a lot better, right? Got a nice little pillow here. <laughs> so guys, I'm telling you, do not lose hope in your pack. Whatever the problem is, stay until the end with them because they're beautiful animals and they're always there for us. And this guy right here is gonna put a full recovery. Right? Promise? Yes. <laughs> But this video, I actually got a gift from my partner, Mr. Dumpling, because he is doing an Oxalato giveaway with a full setup, and it's coming out of his pocket because I said that on the video, so you know he, he can't go back on it. The comment he gets the most like, we're gonna give an Oxalato setup with an Oxalato wow. from yeah. Kevin's pocket. Mm, wait, <laughs> because he's doing that, I went out and I got something for Mr. Dumpling. He came in right now for uh huh, Mr. Mr. Dumpling. Dumpling. Dim Sum Master from Mr. Arpimanek. So we're gonna go I? get him in the office. He's just sitting there probably doing nothing. But you know, he's a little older than me, so I can't say much. We cut him some slack. Yeah, yeah, right? You agree with that? Yeah, it's not about love here. We love, love everybody, right? Whoa. Love. Watch out. I don't think Kasha really really <laughs> agree with the whole love in scenario. Oh, you know, he's not even in the office. What are you doing, bro? Trying to find a house. <laughs> I, I almost bumped into he's, you. He's been trying to find a house for a month. And that's what I'm gonna do for now. I'm gonna sit on my phone and be like, oh, I'm trying to find a new wife. <laughs> hey. Wow. Well, just kidding. House. I have no way to live right now. My house my in wife? LA is sold. So. You will be my wife? I'll no. get your house. <laughs> I saw a if couple you comments. Give me a house, I could be your wife. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is not where we're trying to go in this video. Well, right. <laughs> because you want to be my wife, and because you're a very nice, genuine uh, dim sum master. I got your gift. Really? I paid for it out of pocket. I, this feels like a prank. <laughs> it feels like a prank. I'm getting set up right now. Well, it's not a prank. And it's an appreciation for you giving out your 10-year-old chair. Okay. For, for All right. And also because you're doing a giveaway of the Oxalot and the whole well, setup. Well, I got set up for that too. Well, I'm setting you up with something else. You know how we have problems here um, and we're trying to figure out, but we can't really. The girls are running away. They, they have no makeup on. They keep uh -huh. rotating with the so, camera. Yeah, we have a problem with the water changes because we can't fully design the way we want because Correct. we're waiting for the permits and now mm -hmm. mm -hmm. the good stuff. So that box, so there's something for you that's gonna help us out okay. in the long run. All right, let's see what temporary. <laughs> But can you at least pretend you're happy? Well, I'm, I'm, my guard is up. What if something pops out? What if it's a big snake in there? I don't know what you're up to right well, now. You'd be dead. All right, all right. What do you think it is? Just, what if well, it's an eyeliner? Oh. Well, I assumed it's something work-related because you said it was going to help with the water changes, right? It could be a human helping us with the water changes. A human? Change. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what kind of humans in this box. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to know. Don't show the label. Don't show the label. That's Kevin for you. Smart bot. What's a smart bot? Is it gonna do all the work for me? Uh, it's gonna do a, a lot of work. That looks cool. The reason why I bought it, right, is because it does look like a little Iron Man. It does. It looks like a little robot with the two eyes there, right? You see that? Ideally, what this does is it turns on automatically. So okay. you can leave it plugged in all the time, and when the water level reaches a certain level, it kicks on. Okay. So when we're doing the water changes, you know how we have to little press the little button? Mm -hmm. ah. All right. Let's do the button anymore. All right. Well, we'll, let's put see. It, we'll put it. We'll put it. Do it. Right, I did the whole 
fresh. So have you seen a pump like that before? I mean, I use utility pumps all the time, you know, to, oh, to pump water. So, so that's is, what they're called? Yeah, it's a okay. submersible utility pump. I mean, uh, the, the features on most of them are very basic. You drop it in water and it starts. I was trying to find out for the <laughs> Okay, you're breathing down my neck. All right, so this is cool. <laughs> all these different size attachments, because one of the things that I hate when I buy a pump is you have to go and get all the right attachments to hook up to the type of hose you have, right? And a lot of times we can't find, like, when he was this in LA, a mess. remember, I, I couldn't find exactly what I needed, but somehow, Mr. Dim Sum always finds this stuff. So because now I know where I put it. I give it all to you. All right. If it's where he put it, it's where if he it's put where, it. If nobody moved it. <laughs> I like the little military. So look. it's a little wet here. Looks well, like it was tested out. I'm not gonna lie. I wanted to try a little bit before we even did. So it worked. Definitely looks nice. It definitely looks like a robot. Right. That's for sure. <laughs> looks like Iron Man, right? Look at the face straight on. Yeah. A little bit. Smart bot. So auto flow. What does that mean? I'm guessing that there's a sensor probably from here. These slots. When the water gets up to here, then it'll kick on. Two inch ports. It's very high flow. It's saying super 4200. So I'm guessing it can probably put out 4200 gallons per hour. That's really strong. We need it because a lot of times we're doing water change. And right now the way we're, we're, we're going to show it to you guys. We came up with it just temporary for our needs. Uh, oh, holy crap, dude. Well, no, it'll be good for us because we have so many gallons to pump. So the faster we can get it done, the better. See, we got a smart pump, but not a smart boy. Let me, let me take care of this. Can you grab the hose so I can try to figure okay, out boss, the connection? Yeah, sure, <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. You wanna see my long hose? You wanna see my long hose? Ryan, you don't wanna play that game. Is that adapter on tight? I got. Ex <laughs> I hope so. Got what you need, master. Okay, thank you very much. So, what? so our hose is Ryan's inch and a half. Out. Thread this on, right? Yep. So we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, let's see. All right, that's good. Yeah, let's connect that there. Yeah, that there works. I the, think the happiest part of our day was uh, Tank actually right, doing right. a lot better. Okay, good. Yeah. All right, we're ready to rock and roll. Hey, you want to join us? Okay. So this is how we're doing water change right now because we're not fully set up because we can't yet. Right now it's like pavement style. Ready? We'll take this hose. I'm not going to suck all that poop out. Sounds a little weird, but it's not as true. Before we do this, let's see if the pump really works like they said it would. Oh, let's put plug it in, it in yeah, and put it in there. You don't have to have water, right? You can leave this connected at all times? Yes, this can be connected all the time. And okay. then it's supposed to trigger on its own, which is kind of nice. Well, what I'm seriously wondering is, that pump is so small. You really think it can push that kind of volume, like what they say? The motor has to be pretty fast then. Because the other pump that we normally use in that bucket is just as big and it's pretty slow. <laughs> Oh, I almost sucked oh, on the poop. Oh, that was a close one. All right, so look. All right. The pump is on. I'm sucking the poop out. Let's see when it's going to turn on. Yo, you're going to spray me, bro. I think you're doing that on purpose. No, I'm trying to get the air out of that so it goes faster. It's not even two inches of water yet in the middle part. So let's see when it's going to kick on. It's supposed to kick on by itself. We can still see the bait. Oh, crap. Yeah. It's sucking in air still, but it's, it's already working. Air. Yep. Not bad. It should be full force right there, right? Yep. All right, now let's see. Oh, crap. I'm doing this thing today. Let's see what this hit is real. Ready? Out of the water. There you go. I can feel it's completely off. Yep. Right? Let the pump start. Let's do it again. Drop it back in. Oh, 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 oh. oh nice. So, was it a good gift? All right, I give it to you, I like it. Right, it's gonna help us get this one out faster. We yeah. don't have to keep pressing the button. All right, now let's test it in a different way. Oh. So you know how you were siphoning right there? Uh huh. I wanna just drop this right into the tank. And see it? And not go through this step, right? Save, well, save ourselves a step. Well, so let's be clear to everybody at home. Right now, we're trying not to cross contaminate. So we treat all the system, right? So this system, we use the hose, because they're all treated, we know they're not, they don't have any problems. So putting this on air, all these tanks won't cause anything. No. The ones no. in the back, just to be safe, when they come in, we'll go in there first, we'll quarantine them, and we have the valves already on those. Yeah. So this one, we can try it on that tank. That tank is empty over there. Let me put it on there. Let's see. It's still plugged in. For real? Hey, Matt. I'm gonna be honest here. 
One zero for me. I'm waiting for a gift. I don't know if you, you bought it for yourself. I think you bought it for yourself. No, no, no. That was a gift. Ready? All right. Still plugged in. It's off. His face, eyes. You gotta face the eyes out. Ready? His eyes are on. Look, look, look at him now. Whoa. Wow. How big is this tank, Kevin? It's 50 gallons. See his eyes on. Yeah. Alright, so it's draining out pretty fast. Look at the tank level going down. Oh, yeah. I mean, and it doesn't float, which is really cool. Like, it's just sitting there. I like the size. That's what I really like. Look, with all that weight on this hose, it's still sitting there. Yep. A lot of times, pumps come up. Yeah. All right, we're full over here, so I think you're gonna have to pull it out. We yeah. don't want to flood. So that was pretty quick. Yeah. Yeah. So that pushed out about like 40 gallons in like less than a minute. So still on. Off. Oh. Okay. So this is actually pretty cool. You don't have to ever unplug it. Yeah. That's awesome. This is really neat. I like it. Well, one zero for me. Okay. <laughs> okay. So I'll buy you another one. And then we'll we can both do water changes at the same time, <laughs> twice as fast. So we 20, have 25 mirrors? 325. Oh, wait, no, no, no. That, how big is that? That's 3,000. 3, yeah. the, the, this one's probably like two. Okay, so three, two. What about that one? That one's 13. 13, and then we have that one. That one's also about 13. The idea is to put all four of them right now this way, mm -hmm. right? Set them all up for the rays and all the big fish that we are going to collect through time. Correct. And then we're not ready for that monster tank yet, you know. We need the OnlyFans account, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but the fiberglass tank, we don't know where we're going to set it up. No, not yet. Not yet. We don't even know if we can set it up again. You know, well, we have to find somebody. We have to find uh, a fiberglass specialist, which... I think we're in the right spot with so all the boat area, let's right? Let's talk to fiberglass. Okay. For the, just a dollar a day, the fiberglass <laughs> specialist can help us out. Correct. So, think about all the children that would enjoy this tank. Fish. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. tank. Yeah. Tank with oh, the fish. With fish, fish tank. and tank. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So, fiberglass guy, if you're out there and you can help us out, you know, dim sum, let us know. Yeah, I'll treat you the dim sum. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know where the twelve thousand is going yet, but we're gonna put the fiberglass ponds right here. So he doesn't block the view. Matt's dad actually is a welder, so he's gonna help us bring this tank up high so it's all a nice, neat level. Yep. I mean, we're getting there. It's a lot of work. Yeah, I mean, we, we had to get all our ducks in a row, and this is the row we're up to now. Well, and I'll tell you, that row was very costly. <laughs> we lost a lot of money, we lost a lot of animals. Don't even right. think about it. I don't know why, it's always like that. Like, it's like, I feel like we're doing the right thing, but like, you know, I believe in God and devil and stuff. And I believe mm -hmm. that was just like, watch out, watch out. having a good time. On yeah, this. yeah, like trying to make us quit. But we're not gonna quit. I think that the next step, when do you think we're gonna be able to go to Ohio Fish Rescue? Soon, all right? I think as long as we get two of these up, we can right, go pick them up. Then we can go. All right, so yeah. the idea is to fly there, box them up, fly back, because the flight is only an hour and a half long. I think so. It, it, was, it wasn't that long. It and was better a, than driving. Yeah, where well, the truck would be nine hours, and he already said that his back hurt, so I was going to have to do that drive, and I don't want to drive anymore. I'm driveless. So right now, we're just going to fly there, ship the stingrays back, put them away, and then hopefully get the permit for retail, because a lot of people are asking about when can they start coming in here. Yeah, well, that's still a process that we're working on. Right. Okay, so when so. the town says, good to go, we're good to go. We might have to do some parking things, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah I let Kevin deal with that because he's Too Bob many and things I. on my plate. Yeah, Bob and I just stay here. <laughs> but right now, I think to wrap up this video, you're happy with a gift? Oh, yeah. Yeah, how definitely. We, how are we going to pick the winner for the Oxalato? Didn't you say it was the one with the, the most, most likes. likes on their comments? If you haven't seen that video, go watch the Oxalato video. We're getting it right now. Kevin is giving uh, a whole full setup and Oxalatos as well. I'm, I think I'm going to go make an alias and put a comment and get people to like it. It's kind of messed up. Some kids out there might be happy with that. You might actually like <laughs> get good karma from that, you know? Okay. All right. All right. And now here I'm going to do it. Before we leave, let's go ahead and put Tank on his bed and see how he's doing. Maybe you want to grab the camera because he's heavy. Right now. He, he looks pretty good. I'll take over. So but, uh, with all honesty, without even making things up, I know you, you didn't even know I was going to ask you that question. What? How much percent you thought he was dead? Oh my goodness. Like 99. 
99. The night that she had, he had those seizures, I'd never seen anything like that. He was like all bloodied up. He was slamming all over the place. He was banging. His seizures were so bad, he was banging his head on the ground. And nothing we could do. And I swore like his brain was fried. Like he's not there anymore. I gave up. Honestly, I gave up. I know. He came up to me. He goes, you know what that means, right? It's time to uh, put him down. If he doesn't Yeah, I, and him. I didn't know how to deliver it because he was suffering so badly. It was crazy. And in my, my mind, I'm like, Kevin is already trying to get rid of all the piles of shit everywhere. <laughs> but yeah. no, he was right. And I was like, look, I'm, I talked to God and he I talked suffering. to my parents. And I say, listen, if it's for him, for him to suffer, I don't want to do it. But when I got, dude, when I got there and they were like, look, you got two options. Either you take him or you leave him here. Mm -hmm. We don't have the money to leave him here. So if you take him, he's going to die. That's yeah. what she told me. Yeah. And I said, look, even if the vet put the doubt in our heads. Yeah. Too. I said, if it's from, for him to die, I'd rather him die with us than here by himself. Okay. But without saying anymore, Matt, it's from here. Show them. Bob is over there watching him. <laughs> hey. Thank you. He's still a little doped up. Look. And I think see that compared to his, his head on the ground with his tongue hanging out of his mouth. And now this, it's. Well, totally different, right? Totally different. So we made this little makeshift uh, wheelchair for him. He's looking back and forth. Yeah, he's actually... He's I think, alert. I think he's starting to wake up, to be honest with you. <laughs> but honestly, when we have the, the Brazilian shipment that came in, and we came in here, he was right here, covered in blood, piss, vomit, and poop. And, poop. and I, I didn't see anything move. I thought he was dead. So to see him like this... Is, is amazing and I do appreciate everybody praying, sending all the prayers and all the good thoughts. I think that did, did help a lot in saving his life and we're very thankful for that. So right now, to go home because everybody's tired, you can look at the girls, they're ready to kill us, even Ryan. We're gonna go put him on his bed and call it a day. So if you wanna hold the camera because it's a little heavy. Yeah, I'll, uh, <laughs> I'll defer that to Matt. <laughs> the only problem with him right now is his legs look, they're swollen, but we're massaging it, we're moving them every day. Yeah, and we're hoping that that's gonna go but down. It's all blown up, but I think rubbing it out, um, getting compression socks or wrapping it, and oh yeah, I need to go no help. for that. Yeah. yeah, I have some gloves. I have you have it? Yes. Look, Bubba, I can't believe he's actually holding himself like that. You know, at least he's holding his head up now. Yeah, before his head was just he's going on the ride. Yeah. So now we can roll him outside. He can watch the birds. You know, get some sun. Oh, we're actually putting him in the room tonight? Yeah. Okay, cool. He's, gonna... he's actually got a nice five-star bedroom over here. Let me get some pads. <laughs> oh my goodness, is that a queen-size bed? Yeah. You're gonna get him on that? Yeah. <laughs> Let me get pads. Dude, ready for this? Yeah. You yeah. might touch a little bit of pee. No, no, that's fine. That's See, fine. that's what's up. Oh, that's why he gave you the back end. And I'll tell you, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I'll tell you what, we were trying to hide Matt forever until we reach a million subscribers just as a joke. Yeah. But for Tank, Matt's here. Yeah. But if you guys, Love what we do. Love this dog. Love the fish koi king. Yeah. The dumpling samurai and the arapaima neck. Thumbs up. Give us a, a share, like, subscribe. Yeah. We'll help us out. And I'm still koi neck. We'll still, keep this I'll guy. Still an appearance. You never know. Fish out of water. There you go. And we'll keep him, you know, with a job. So we got to keep yeah. up. Come on, big boy. You know which side to go down, right? Yeah. This side, right? Yeah, I think Matt has it correct already. Yeah? Yes. Sweet. Oh. Dude, you're gonna have a good time tonight. I'll make sure Sugar's locked in here. <laughs> <laughs> He's not gonna deflate the bed, is he? He's so heavy. No, this is it's not a real the, mattress. It's a, oh, it's a real mattress. Yeah, this yeah. is legit. Yeah, this what? Is what? Is what? Oh. what? Oh. Yeah. what? Yeah. Does he drills a lot? Five, five star room service. I know. Yeah. And this is gonna go on the front and back end because you never know. Okay. All right, so we're gonna take care of him. I gotta give him his meds actually. Again, thanks you guys for watching. Take care. Hey. Oh, dude, I'm sorry. Jeez. Take care of everybody here. <laughs> I don't even know what to say anymore. I love you guys. I'll see you next time. He, he ran over my big toenail.